another video. So today I wanted to share with you guys what is in me and Gianna's diaper bag. So we definitely have a minimalist diaper bag, you guys. It's actually a mini backpack. It is not an actual quote quote diaper bag. So we kind of DIY'd our own diaper bag. It is Steve Madden. I think it was like 40 or 50 bucks. It was not expensive. I noticed a lot of diaper bags were very, very, very expensive. And so I decided, hey, why can't I just pick a bag that I like and just make it my diaper bag? I'd like to preface this video with saying I do breastfeed Gianna exclusively. We don't do bottles pretty much ever. If we do do bottles, it's because I'm leaving her with someone else, so I never bring bottles with me. So you will see our bag's pretty small. Um, there's no bottles in here. So if you are looking for that type of video, save your time. I'm very much uh, a light packer. I don't like carrying our whole lives with us. I do keep some stuff in the car as a staple, um, like extra diapers, extra wipes in case we need them. But in this bag, I like to keep it very, very light. Gianna is heavy enough on her. So let's get into what's in the bag. Uh, first, let's get into what's hanging off the bag. So this little cute little hedgehog, if you guys watched my Bath and Body Works haul video, you saw where I got this little guy. He was about $7, I think, at Bath and Body Works. It, he might have been on sale, but basically he can hang off any bag and he holds your travel size hand sanitizer right on the bottom. So I thought that was super cute and convenient. Um, of course, with a small baby or children in general, or just you yourself, you're always using hand sanitizer, especially in the winter time. There's a lot of flu and a lot of sickness going around. So this is just a super convenient way to have it always attached to your bag. Then you can just pop them out and change out your flavor anytime you want. Right now we have your magic. It's a unicorn flavor. Sanitizer on the go. So that's first, and then inside the bag, you guys have probably seen this before, but I'm gonna keep showing it because I love it and we use it all the time. This is a diaper clutch that I found on Amazon.com. I will leave the link below. Guys, I love this thing. I think it was only like 20 bucks. It's super, super luxurious. Um, the outside is like a faux kind of suede or I don't know what material, it's just very soft. It wraps into a clutch. The back has a zipper if you want to put like your extra diapers or your stuff, and then you can just stick this in your purse, literally. You can do that, so I don't have anything in this pouch right now, but you um, have that option. And then it opens up this way. This side has a pillow for their head, so when they're laying on that like really hard changing mat, in the bathroom, their little head's padded. This part is that faux suede, very, very soft, almost like Sherpa material. It's so soft and warm, you guys, and it's actually pretty thick, so it's great for the winter when it's kind of more chilly. And then hanging the, on the clutch part, there's another zippered bag, where, which is where I keep our diapers. And then it has this very convenient strap for the wipes. So I love this thing, you guys. And again, you can stick this in whatever bag you're using. So it's just super convenient. Like if you're just running to the store and you don't need your whole diaper bag, you can literally just throw this into your bag. It's also washable. You see, I just got a little bit of lipstick on here and I'm not worried about it because you can literally stick this thing in the washing machine and it comes out just like this. So I love this. This was a great buy off of Amazon. The brand is called Mo Baby. And again, I'll drop the link below. I, I think it was 20 or $25. It was super inexpensive for the quality that it is. So I highly, highly recommend this. We also have an extra bag in our diaper bag. This cute little marbled um, it's actually a cosmetic bag that we got off of Amazon. I think it was only five or ten dollars. Don't quote me on that, but I will leave the link below. It has this cute little tassel and gold detailing, which I love. But inside, we keep even more diapers. 
We also keep her cute little brush and comb set. Her cute little brush and comb set that we got off of Amazon. We also keep an extra outfit and bow. So her little extra outfits in here. A cute little outfit I got from Target back in the day. I think before she was even born I got that. And I keep an extra little pair of footsies because her shoes and socks are always falling off. So if I lose one and I need to replace the whole pair that we're wearing that day, I always keep an extra pair in this little bag. So this is great to keep the extra supplies in. The reason why I got a cosmetic bag is because it is waterproof. I also usually keep an empty plastic bag in there. But usually we do have an empty plastic bag just in case of poop explosions so that we can put her soiled clothes in there and then keep them nicely into this cosmetic bag. The reason why I got a cosmetic bag instead of again going the whole diaper bag route which you usually get some sort of bag like this in a diaper bag is those bags are usually about $300 and I did not see the point in that especially when I couldn't even find a diaper bag I actually loved. So to me, spending five, ten dollars on this little bag, kind of creating your own setup, and only getting what you actually need and use in your diaper bag, to me is way smarter, way more cost efficient, and I totally like the design better because I can get exactly the things that I like and want in the bag. So this comes in handy. Also, if we need extra room in the bag, I can always take this part out and put this in the car. And then we have extra room if I want to stick my stuff in the bag and only carry one bag. Speaking of which, also in the bag is my passport holder. I won't show you my passport for security reasons, but it has my passport and one credit card in there. So usually this is all I'm taking. I have my money, I have my ID, I have my phone, I have her stuff and we are ready to go. I can put this on my back and have my hands free. So I really, really love this bag. So that is why I keep this in here. Um, of course, I have a whole big wallet with other cards and things that I need, but I don't need that on a day-to-day -day basis. So when we're just running errands or doing something simple, I can just pop this in here and carry just this one bag. So also in this bag, we have extra hand sanitizer and we also have some toys. This is one of her favorites. You can see it's been very lovingly used, but this is a baby Einstein rattle that plays music. It has these really cool little rings that they can bite on and play with and make noise with. The little smiley face that they love watching and then it plays different classical music um, and they can push the button themselves. This also lights up. I won't play it right now because she's taking a nap and we want to keep it that way. We also have this awesome little teething ring, little elephant, so cute. You can freeze her. Gianna is teething like crazy right now, so I have to keep a teether at all times. And this is one of her favorites. She can hold it and she can bite on the ears, bite on the legs. And it's nice and sturdy, so it gives them a really nice resistance to on their gums, so it feels really good. And then last but not least, we have her extra Nook pacifiers. Love this brand of pacifiers. This is literally the only pacifier she'll use. We've tried to like do a switcheroo with the other pacifiers we've had, and she literally will just spit them out of her mouth. This is the only one that she'll use suck on, keep in her mouth, put it in her mouth herself. So I always keep an extra one just in case, you never know. And then I always keep an extra pacifier clip. Um, these things are great. If you have a baby that likes to drop their pacifier everywhere and you're tired of always cleaning them, this is perfect. This clips to their bib or their top. And then this part is what you hook on to the pacifier. So you string that through, then you string the clip part through, and voila, it's attached. And then you just clip this part to their bib, or if they're not wearing a bib, you can clip it to their collar. But it's super convenient. Whoever thought of this, genius. Um, the brand that we have, I believe this says Dodo Babies. These were also a gift, um, so I didn't, I don't know what store has these. I don't know if it's a boutique brand or what, but I'm sure if you Google the brand, you can find them. 
and I'm sure tons of other brands make the same type of thing but this is a lifesaver so I always keep an extra one just in case we misplace the one that she's using for the day. So that is what is in and on our diaper bag. I hope you enjoyed this video, got inspired to kind of par down your diaper bag. You do not have to carry everything in your diaper bag, you guys, especially if you're only gonna be gone for a couple of hours, which is usually the norm with the baby. You don't need everything. A change of clothes, definitely extra diapers and wipes, a couple of toys, their pacifier, whatever they use to self soothe tons of hand sanitizer and you are good to go drop a comment below and let me know what you have in your diaper bag and if you have a uh, what's in my diaper bag video drop your link below i love watching what's in my diaper bag videos i don't know why i kind of binge watch those so it's one of my favorite kind of videos to watch um, but this is our minimalist pared down version i would say if i did carry a bottle um, I would just put a bottle holder in here I don't think I would take any more than one or two bottles with me at any given time unless of course we're going on a longer trip which I have a bigger duffel type of diaper bag for that um, but yeah pare down your diaper bag you guys we only get one back so I hope you enjoyed this video hope it helped you out in any way shape or form if it did please give it a like and subscribe to this channel if you like to see mommy and baby videos, lifestyle, and commentary. And until the next one, bye!